Flames and smoke filled the sky in this Flushing neighborhood early Monday morning as two families tried to get out of their burning home. I was sleeping in just a couple of houses down. People were dying. So that that makes me feel uh, a little shaky. Sadly, the fire was no match for 65 year old Stephen Blumling and his six year old son, Sean, who officials say were pronounced dead in the home. Oh my God. Six years old. Six years old. I remember the little boys. They was coming, playing, passing by all the time with the father, the mother. So sad. Sean's twin brother, who was also in the house, was rushed to Jacoby Medical Center for severe burns. Their mother, the only survivor, at his bedside. He was very nice. He'd always um, would ride his bike and he had a buggy and he had, would have the twins in the back. Absolutely adorable little kids, always active doing something in the yard. Officials say the fast moving fire broke out around one this morning at the two story home on 157th Street near 46th Avenue in Queens. Dozens of firefighters responded, putting out the flames in about an hour. The home is so badly burned, the Department of Buildings issued a full vacate order. Late Monday, others who lived in the home and managed to escape returned to get what was left of their belongings. Relieved they were able to make it out, but heartbroken. Others in the home did not survive.